So I got some, I got something good to look up for too. Now see, um, no, no, no matter how you, uh, how old you are, yeah. If you want to do something, you can do any, any time. No matter your age. No matter your age. No matter where you come from. No. No matter your education. And, and uh, one thing you gonna be, you, you gonna be learning into the last day. You're gonna continue to learn until you learn die. Until, until you die. You know, there's actually a, a phrase that I've kind of continued to grow by is, uh, you know, <clears throat> you are who you surround yourself with. And that's kind of a phrase that we always say uh, as accountability. Um, but you're in business for yourself. Right. It's you, mom, and the kids. Right, right. Because you now have some of my siblings that work with you. Uh, and they've kind of branched out and done their own kind of construction business, right? Right. right. Even though we, we have given advice, go do something different. Right. They've seen you become successful in that field. Right, right. Which that kind of makes me think of like, well, why should someone go do something different if they see what you're doing is working? Right, right. What would you say to that? Why would you tell them not to do it when they see that obviously it works? Yeah, yeah, because uh, you, you're going to be the simple, you know. Yeah? If this, this, somebody see you, the, the, uh, do you do something that is worth it? Yeah. If you don't, if you don't, you don't believe, you know, that's, yeah, 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 I think really what I'm trying to ask is that because I remember I, I see a lot of Hispanic people staying in the labor field. Right. Has, labor field's great, and I'm glad that you're doing it for yourself. Right. Because if you were doing it for somebody else, yeah. you wouldn't have all this. I know. Uh, I remember you told me that at a, uh, when I was a kid. You're like, you better go do something for yourself. Right. Otherwise, you're gonna keep selling your selling your time for a paycheck. Right. Do you see a lot of your guys live paycheck to paycheck? Yeah, yeah. But you give them the opportunity to go do what you do, right? Right, right, right. And they don't take it? No. See, how many siblings do you have? Hmm? How many siblings? How many brothers and sisters do you have? Nine. So you're one of ten? Yes. You know what happens? Mm -hmm. I'm one of ten. Yeah, yeah. Ain't that crazy? Yeah, I'm one yeah. of ten. And would you say out of the ten, they're all like you? Or you're like the, the, the weird one? Uh, probably Probably the weird one, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you remember Robert Kiyosaki? Yeah. He says, weird, rich, yeah, yeah. normal, broke. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm the weird one. Yeah. I'll be the weird one all day. Yeah. I think people think I'm weird because I'm doing a video. Yeah, yeah, uh, the thing with crazy. Yeah. yeah. But I think it's the crazy ones that change the generations. Mm -hmm. And you just pass your crazy on to me. Yeah. Never guess so. Yay! The only, the only people, they, 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 they do things different because... They're crazy. Why would you stay the same? If you see what everyone else has gotten by doing exactly what they're doing, you know what you're going to end up with. Because uh, because uh, they're following the the how do you say that? What are you, what are you trying to say? Uh, uh, the, the rat race, yeah. the, uh, what everyone else is doing, yeah, the, yeah. The, the normal, the yeah, mediocrity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, I think what, what, what I get excited about is that you have a business that you do outside of your construction business. Right. And now they're both successful in their own, in their own mediums. Right. Um, and I love that you have multiple, for, so, multiple flows of income, right? Right. Um, now this isn't an, uh, uh, an offer solicitation to do, do any of these businesses, but I think it's a good thing can you explain to them why you want to have multiple flows of income and not just rely on one paycheck? Uh, how, how, do you, how, how do you, what do you mean? What I mean is, instead of having one paycheck, mm -hmm. give me an example. You go work for a job, nine to five, 10 to six, 11 to seven, 40 days a week, I'm sorry, five days a week, working 40 hours a week for one paycheck right. or two paychecks a month. You have multiple jobs that come in, right? Right, right, right. And you sell multiple products with yeah. your other business. Yeah, yeah. How have those other multiple flows of income kind of helped you? Oh, they, they help me 100%. Yeah? Yes. Because you have some checks that are really big, mm -hmm. and then you have some that are smaller than others, right? Right, right. But you don't think one's more important than the others. No, 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 no. 
because the big one is great because it helps you get ahead. Right, right. But even those small ones, I know in my own success, I'm not as successful as you are financially just yet, but I have multiple flows of income that come into me, whether the check is a small amount or a few hundred, a few thousand dollars. I appreciate them all yeah. because it's God that's allowed me to have that. Actually, I want to speak on that. Where has God put, been a place in your success? It's been, it's, been, it's been great. Yeah. Do you give your glory to God? Is it all because of God or is it all because of you? Yeah. Uh, I, put, I put God for us okay. before anything else. Everything. Mm -hmm. I mean, because I mean, you've been in church ever since I've known Yeah. And uh, to do any, 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 anything you want to do in life, if you want to do it by yourself, uh -huh. if you think you, you're really strong and you, no, that's not going yeah. to happen. Yeah. That's not going to do. It's not, it's, not, it's not going to happen. Has there ever come a point in your in your business where you're, or, or let's just say you're at a low. Mm. You're just like, oh my goodness, I just want to give up. And then God's pulled you out of that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you give me an example when that's ever happened? Like a time period of memory? I was, I was, uh, when I, when the economy fall, you know, fall apart, you know, yeah. I, I was, I was so upset, you know, for people, people, uh, they got me with my money. Yeah. And, uh, I was, some days I was feeling really, 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 that I, I didn't, I don't know, I don't know what to do, you know. Okay. But, uh, as long as I will live in God and hope. Uh -huh. You know, every, everything come. You had that faith? Mm -hmm. And did you ever get to a point where, well, let's just say, because I remember you said people owed you like six figures. Mm -hmm. I think I remember one time you said someone owed you $300,000. Mm -hmm. right. Like one person, right? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know about you. Yeah. If someone owes me three hundred grand, <laughs> we fighting. Yeah. Like those are fighting words right there. They're fighting numbers. Yeah, but I... Uh... What did you do? Like, 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 how did you handle someone owing you so much money? And then ain't nothing you can do about it because the economy collapsed. Yeah, just because uh, you don't you don't have a, you don't have it. I was I was poor in my on my from my my my, my mind my mental you know. Like you're poor mentally. Yeah, yeah. And uh, what does that mean when you say you're poor mentally? What does that mean? I I didn't have much information. Okay. And right, right, right now, uh, everything, everything is, is changed. Uh -huh. I don't want, for, I don't want somebody for nothing. I, I, I gotta make my, my, my time worth, my money worth. Right, right, right. So if you, before you do a job, you gotta make sure the mo the money's worth your time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And I don't worry, I, I'm not cheap. You're not cheap. No, no. Because no. you've got experience, and now you're, you're worth it yeah, to the yeah. marketplace. Mm -hmm. Um. I want to go back to what, what you what were you saying when the economy collapsed, because I remember. Mm -hmm. I mean, I remember this because I watched. This is really when I think I started to pursue our relationship. Because uh, just kind of give you guys an, an example yeah. or, or, or a story. There was quite a few years I didn't see you. Mm -hmm. I remember from fourteen to seventeen, I said, well, "Dang it, I'm gonna take a greyhound to come see you." <laughs> and, and, and from there, that's when I said, "Listen, my dad's not around." I gotta go pursue that relationship. Right, right. And not on, not because I, I mean, I wanted to be around you. And I wanted to be around the rest of the siblings, but I was hungry. I wanted to learn. Mm -hmm. So I got out of my comfort zone. I saved up some money. Go get on a Greyhound bus, <laughs> packed up a bunch of clothes, and let's go. Yeah. And then from there, I mean, I've come here every year. It's right. now been eleven years. Isn't that crazy how fast it's going by? No, no. Oh, seventeen, and now we're twenty-eight. Um, but, it, but it, it's been a great journey. So now where you're at right now, are you comfortable with where you're at making good money or are you striving to get better? No, no, I'm, uh, I'm trying, I'm trying to come up. I'm, I'm, I, uh, I'm not comfortable with what I, what I, what I'm at. But most people would be comfortable with yeah, where you're at, no, right? No, no, no me. No. Uh, 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 I, I keep you gotta keep, keep growing. growing. Keep growing in, uh, in, in all areas. In all areas? Yeah. What's one of your main areas in 2019 you're gonna get better at? Uh, first, you know, be uh, 
to spend more time with my family. Okay. That's a good one. And, uh, but, uh, to spend time with your family, you, 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 you gotta, you, you gotta have results, you know. Because, oh, you gotta have results. Yeah. Yeah. Because, uh, uh, you're not gonna be with your family if you broke. No. No, because they're gonna tell you to get your behind off the couch and go to go get, make some money, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. But you put in the time mm -hmm. to get where you're at. Yeah. See, I, I, I want to bring up two things that guys we said off camera last night in our conversation is he says that you are you have to be around people that are higher than you. Right, right, right. To pull you up for a cl closer, further. And what was the last thing we were talking about last night? We were talking about. Because I, uh, I was telling you when we were at dinner last night, when I was eating my tamales, and it was really good too. Um, I said, man, I cannot wait to hurry up and get back to work. Mm -hmm. And what did you tell me last night? Uh, working, uh, if, you got, if you got the money, you, you, don't, you, don't, you don't have to worry about going go back to work uh, tomorrow or the next day. No, and what did you say? You, you, <laughs> you said, if you had the money, would you go back to work tomorrow? I said... Yeah, because I'm I'm motivated and I'm and I'm driven to do what, what I'm doing. Right. But for most people, they have to go back to work because they need a check. I know, I know. And I think we've got the luxury to where we're at now. Mainly you. Right. <laughs> Definitely not me. <laughs> I gotta keep grinding. Right, right, right now you. <clears throat> I'm just getting my, my, my you, thing going. You have to. You know, you, you gotta do working hard right now when you're young. Yeah. Uh, but um, um, uh, my, what I was telling you last night, there was just a simple, no, no. It, That's not everything. No, no. What I was asking you, if you got the money, that you don't have to go back to work on uh, one week, two weeks. Yeah. You know, that's all you need, you know. You know, for example, if you, don't, if you want to go take a vacation, or one day you don't, you don't feel like to go to work, you gonna have to go to work because you need you don't have the money. You ain't got the results, like you said. If if if, if you got a I got a business that I, I got ten thousand dollars coming every month. You think you think uh, uh, I'm going I'm going to work tomorrow? Um, you probably, but most people no, mm, not at all. No, no, not at all. You know, but uh, I I'll tell you this. My goal is to give myself like the double my pay raise of what I made this last year, uh, in addition in, in multiple in multiple areas. Um, but my only way to get there is by leveraging my time with people. Mm -hmm. uh, I think I, that's something I think I want to and just wrapping this up, guys, is in your business. Is it always about you doing all the work, or is it you building a team of people around you? Build a team around me. Why is that important to build a team of people? Because uh, that people is going to be working when, 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 you, when you're on vacation. <laughs> <laughs> so having people work with you or for you, so you eventually get results. Right. But right. isn't that bad though? Isn't it bad to make money off of other people? No, because every, every, everybody, everybody wants to make money. It, uh, Everyone, everybody wants to get on the same level I am or so. Right. So they're going to have to keep working. So most people, you would think, the American dream is if they can see what I have and they can do the exact same, they're willing to go do it. Right, right. So that's, that makes it an even playing field. Mm -hmm. And that's the main message I hope you guys get from this thing is it doesn't matter where you come from. It doesn't matter education level. Obviously, it doesn't matter what you look like. Right. Right? Would you agree? Not that's right. <laughs> and thank God for these good genes, right? Um, doesn't matter your experience in the very beginning. Right, right. As long as you can stay consistent and getting better, consistent. reading, uh, reading, going to seminars, getting around people that are better, keep your God first. Right. Keep your family growing. Right. And over time, this thing eventually comes together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, can, would you agree that there, there are certain times you can work hard, but be in the wrong vehicle? Yeah, yeah, you, 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 can, work, you, you, can, you can work in 24 hours a day. Yeah. But if you're on a, on a 
Wrong vehicle, you're not gonna make it. No, what's an example of a wrong vehicle for someone that is an entrepreneur and that wants to go make a million dollars a year? Or just an example. A wrong vehicle? Yeah, what's the wrong vehicle to do that? Uh, you have to get the perfect business, you know, the per perfect... Uh, you said it's a business. Yeah. You need a business to do it. Yeah, a business. Now, not every business is gonna pay you to make a million dollars a year. No, no, no. <clears throat> But you need a business to go do that. Right, right. Can you do that having a job for the average person? Yeah, you can do it. To make a million dollars at a job? No, 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 okay, no. Okay. No, no. Okay. You, can, you can start a, your own business when you, on the same time you, you got, you, you got you working on, on your regular job. Uh -huh. the, the, only, the only difference that you're going to make is working after after. After you work. So working your business after your job. After your job. Is, is when you're gonna make the money. Ah. You work you you work in eight hours for the for, for your boss. How many hours you work for you? <laughs> That's a good one. That's a good one. Yeah. yeah. Uh so guys, working your business, working your side hustle after you work your forty hour job. Right. Cause there's nothing wrong with having a job. No, no. They a lot don't. of people need a job. Yeah. But you got to work yourself out of it. Right. I know I had to work myself out of my corporate job. Mm -hmm. I mean, and it wasn't easy. Right. And you know, every day, every year still isn't easy as an entrepreneur. Some days you wake up motivated. Some days you're waking up to a bunch of bull crap and people stuff you got to deal with and, and people you owe money to and people that owe you money, right? Right. Um, and in your line of work, you're bidding for jobs all the time, right? Right, right. And then do some people fail on you yeah, yeah some people cost you money right thank god not everyone is, has to deal with that on, on the scale that you're at right. but eventually i think most people would like to get to where you're at yeah um so now yes say what's your name know. you know your name yeah i want my water you want your water yeah give them your affirmations real quick I don't know. what's your affirmations I don't know. i'm alive i'm alive i wake I yes, high five. <laughs> I'm a winner. I'm a winner. I slide. I'm a leader. A leader. I slide. I'm a champion. A champion. I'm a Camargo. A Camargo. Right. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> say, say, good night. What's up? Okay, say good night. Good night. Welcome to the flow show. Flow show. Yeah, we'll get it down. Have a good night, guys. Perfect.